Today, I have a therapy session with a singer or something like that. Zizi. <laughs> Zinzi. Okay. Zizi is a troubled little Zoomer. She had a lot of trauma growing up. Correct. She has no money, no talent, no bitches, no good looks, any abilities, friends, whatever, you know. And today, we're gonna help her to walk through her trauma. Good to have you here, Zizi. First of all, your name, Zizi. It sounds like something Chinese to me. Are you from China? And before you say anything. Okay. I don't support this communism bullshit, okay? So just so you know. Okay. Um, no, I've gotten uh, that I look um, like I'm from some part Can of you, Asia. For, for the camera, can you endorse independence of Taiwan? <sighs> Let's get you cancelled. Can you say, my name is Easy and I endorse independence of Taiwan? What are your thoughts on the Tiananmen massacre? Wow. We're going in strong here. Um, all massacres are bad, that's all I can say. So this is a therapy session, so let's talk about therapy stuff. Emotions. Tell me about every single emotion you ever had. Oh, that would... That would... Have you ever been sad? Uh, yes. Why? Um... Clinical depression. <laughs> you said you went to therapy before. Yes. How was it? My first therapist uh, kind of just stopped talking to me, kind of just abandoned me out of nowhere. Is that a common thing for you, for people to abandon you like that? Oh. Um. <laughs> No. <laughs> Back when I was dating, yes, but that's just dating culture, isn't it? You have a girlfriend now? Yes. And you're a girl? Yes, that too. It's a little bit gay, if you ask me. How did you find her? Hinge. Do you like pick-up lines, or how does it work? Maybe a weird question. Um, I'm pretty unhinged. Uh, I looked through your Instagram and uh, oh yeah. you give a vibe of a someone who does not smell good in person. Oh. You know, something about you. Okay. Anyway, tell me about your childhood. F okay. Uh, childhood lovely parents you ever had a job yes i have actually i worked in a pub bartending it's pretty chill tits were all right yeah i like them too it sounded like i said tits i said tips yeah i know what you mean yeah. let's talk about your music okay you went to music university mm -hmm. what did you study music you have 36 monthly listeners on Spotify. <laughs> Does it mean you have 35 friends? Um, that you ask to listen to your shit every month? I actually have less than that, so... Good music. Mm. What's preventing you from making it? <laughs> You're funny. Very funny. How do you write a song? Describe it to me. Well... You like, you think about what you want to write, and then you write it. What's your favorite book? Ot the Ottenheim books, Chris Riddell. Um, it's about this girl, she goes to boarding school. Bowling school? And boarding, not balding. You'll probably be balding in a couple years. I know. 